Drugs is a borderless crime. It's a threat to human health and national security. And it has been creeping on us for a very long time. India's drug problem. It was in the 1980s things had started going worse. India was emerging as an important transit point for drug traffickers owing to its geographical location. As the drug supply increased, multifold challenges came to the fore. This led to the enactment of Narcotics Drug and Psychotropic Substances Act 1985 to combat drug trafficking. Since the drug law enforcement is a multi-agency function, the Narcotics Control Bureau was constituted as the central authority on 17th March 1986 to fight illegal drugs and for enforcement and coordination. Since then, NCB has been working in association with various narcotics and drug law enforcement agencies within the country and also as India's nodal point with international agencies like UNODC, INCB, etc. India has entered into bilateral and multilateral agreements with many countries for mutual cooperation for reducing demand and preventing illicit trafficking in narcotics, drugs and psychotropic substances. Bharat Sarkar और राज्य सरकारें ड्रग्स के व्यापार खासकर सीमा पार से जो अवैध व्यापार चल रहा है उसे रोकने के लिए कई कदम उठा रही है भारत सरकार ने ड्रग्स के खिलाफ चौतरफा प्रहार करने की राष्ट्रीय स्तर पर योजना भी तैयार की है the Narcotics Control Bureau is committed to government of India's anti-drug policy and it is leaving no stone unturned to achieve the mission of Drug-Free India campaign. The agency is working on all fronts in a strategic manner, from supply and demand reduction to harm reduction, At present, NCB functions under the Ministry of Home Affairs and operates through its offices spread across the country. NCB works with central and state government agencies, paramilitary forces and other civil society institutions. Manya Pradhan Mantri Ji ke Magdarsan mein Guru Mantrale ne drug ke khilaap zero tolerance ki niti apnai hai. Mera manna hai ki nase ki samasya राष्ट्रीय सुरक्षा के लिए भी एक बहुत बड़ी चुनौती है जिसको सभी के समन्वय से ही रोका व समाप्त किया जा सकता है मोदी जी के नेतृत्व में हमने लड़ाई को समन्वयित और संस्थागत बनाया है इसके लिए गृह मंत्रालय के नारकोटिक्स कंट्रोल ब्यूरो के तत्वाधान में नारको समन्वय तंत्र की स्थापना की है जिसका उद्देश्य सभी एजेंसियों के बीच में समन्वय एवं तालमेल स्थापित करना है जिससे ड्रग की तस्करी पर अंकुश लगाने में हमें पूर्ण रूप से कामयाबी मिल सकती है। The third apex level end court committee meeting under the chairmanship of the honourable Home Minister chalked out a detailed action plan। भारत सरकार के मान्य गृहमंत्री की अध्यक्षता में एपिक्स कमेटी मीटिंग का तीसरा सत्र दिसंबर 2021 में हुआ। इस दौरान भारत की जीरो टॉलरेंस अगेंस्ट ड्रग्स पॉलिसी को आगे लेते हुए कई महत्वपूर्ण निर्णय लिए गए इनमें से एक निर्णय है एनकॉर्ड पोर्टल का स्थापना करना जो कि स्टेट्स को मदद करेगा दूसरा निर्णय है कि जो चार टायर मैकेनिज्म है एनकॉर्ड का उसको रेगुलरली करना और हर स्टेट को उसमें इन्वॉल्व करना और ए एंटी नारकोटिक्स टास्क फोर्स हर स्टेट में स्थापित करना तीसरा निर्णय है एक नारकोटिक्स कनाइन पूल जो एक अपने आप में बहुत बड़ा एसेट बन सकता है स्थापित करना जो स्टेट्स को और सेंट्रल एजेंसीज को भी मदद कर सके चौथा निर्णय है एक नेशनल नारकोटिक्स हेल्पलाइन की स्थापना करना जिसे मानस की संज्ञा दी गई मुझे लगता है ये सभी डिसीशंस बहुत कारगर और 
गेम चेंजिंग साबित हो सकती है एन सी बी हेज अ वास्ट मैंडेट एंड इट इज बिकम मोर चैलेंजिंग सिंस ड्रग ट्रैफिकर्स हैव शिफ्टेड टू द यूज ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी लाइक डार्क नेट टू सेल ड्रग्स फर्दर दिटुएशन इज बिकम ग्रिम सिंस द ऑनसेट ऑफ पैंडेमिक As per World Drug Report 2021, the lockdown has accelerated drug trafficking through internet, and it is estimated that the dark web drug markets are now worth 315 million dollars annually. During the pandemic, a lot of traffic shifted to the courier agencies. Order would go through dark net, payment through would happen through cryptocurrency. We were uh, freezing bitcoins and etc. In some cases, also. NCB has managed to anticipate changes in criminal strategies and tactics and the agency is now better equipped to meet these latest challenges through the use of technology satellite imagery and cyber forensics kis tarike ke drugs kis countries se un drugs ka yahan par smuggling ho raha hai kaun se routes ko smugglers use kar rahe hain kaun se major syndicates hain kaun se major network hain jo ki internationally and nationally ऑपरेट कर रहे हैं इस सभी तरीके का डेटा जो है हम लोग इकट्ठा करते हैं उसके ऊपर रेगुलर स्टडी करके रिसर्च करते हैं इट इज एस्टिमेटेड दैट द ड्रग ट्रेड इज अप्रोक्सीमेटली 400 बिलियन डॉलर्स बिजनेस द मनी फ्रॉम द ड्रग ट्रेड फंड्स टेररिज्म आर्म्स ट्रैफिकिंग एंड मनी लॉन्ड्रिंग नशीले पदार्थों का दुरुपयोग न केवल समाज को खोखला बनाता है बल्कि नशीली दवाओं की तस्कर से अर्जित धन देश की सुरक्षा के लिए भी बहुत बड़ा खतरा है मुझे विश्वास है कि एनसीबी और सभी हितधारों को कोई सामूहिक प्रयास से अपेक्षित सफलता हासिल होगी एनसीबी वर्क्स राउंड द क्लॉक टू बस दीज इंटरनेशनल सिंडिकेट्स एंड दस इंश्योर सेफ्टी ऑफ द कंट्री इन द रीसेंट इयर्स एंड मंथ्स एंड वीक्स द नार्कोटिक्स कंट्रोल ब्यूरो हैज हैड मेजर सीजर्स बिकॉज ऑफ heightened coordination between ncb state police and agencies national agencies like the nia coast guard and the navy as well as the intelligence agencies at the national level and finally as a result of coordination between ncb and the international drug law enforcement agencies of other countries we have had major seizures across the board on international waters national waters on sea ports on land borders as well as in the aerial route through the airlines this points to a good development and points to a more effective coordination in the future kuch information deni hai aapko NCB garners intelligence to its vast network of informers and conducts raids in close cooperation with other drug law enforcement agencies. Recognizing drug trafficking as a national security issue, NCB is in coordination with other sister agencies both national and international is conducting operations all over the country. NCB on its own is also carrying out various such operations inside the country. In India drugs work 1881 crores were seized between 2018 and 2021. This is three times the value of drugs seized between 2011 and 2014. About 35 lakh kilograms of drugs were confiscated in the country between 2018 and 2021. We are facing this great challenge which is being aided by newer technology like VoIP communication, fake SIMs, social media networks. and latest threat is coming from drones we are joining hands with our sister agencies along with supply reduction ncb also works extensively in the field of drug demand reduction anti drug awareness campaigns are organized around the year to save people from falling prey to the ill effects of drugs and substance abuse ncb has started an online e pledge campaign say yes to life say no to drugs This pledge has been taken up by millions of people across the country. Narcotics Control Bureau endeavors for a drug-free society through coordination and cooperation with all stakeholders and creating synergy amongst them. NCB also plays an important role in the field of drug demand reduction by sensitizing people about the dangers of drug abuse through conducting awareness programs.
NCB ensures harm reduction for victims of drug abuse through its association with drug rehabilitation centers. जहां एक तरफ हम ये प्रयास कर रहे हैं कि लोग ड्रग्स से दूर हों, ड्रग्स से दूर रहें, वहीं दूसरी तरफ जो लोग इसकी चपेट में आ गए हैं, उन्हें शिक्षित करने से लेकर उनके उपचार और पुनर्वास पर भी ध्यान दिया जा रहा है। Through its international coordination activities, NCB has also brought home innocent citizens falsely convicted in drug cases on foreign soil. There is a vast spectrum of activities that the Narcotics Control Bureau has been entrusted with. NCP plays a very important role in the capacity building and training of various drug law enforcement officers of various agencies and states. In association with BPRND, NCB has developed five training modules which are meant for various rank officers like SPs, DSPs and intelligence officers. In addition to that, uh, public prosecutors education department officials and civil societies are also being trained in drug law enforcement provisions and awareness activities. As India celebrates Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav, Narcotics Control Bureau is working on all fronts with greater synergy to fulfill the vision of drug-free India. Apne achhe swasthakaliye se no to drugs.